I'm Alex Herring, Senior Editor with Gifts and Decorative Accessories. And with me today is Chris Salt from Fair Trade Federation. Chris, thank you so much for being here. Uh, and I know yesterday in the pavilions you were giving a seminar about fair trade. Um, and I, I really loved how you were explaining sort of the differences in the labels and what retailers can be looking for. So can you kind of explain to me um, what, what you should do? Because I know there's a lot of confusion around that yeah. area. Yeah, most people are introduced to fair trade usually through coffee or chocolate, right? You see the little fair trade symbol. Yes. And that's really great. That's a certification label that usually is associated with agricultural products like cho chocolate, coffee, bananas. Um, and then there's also verification uh, organizations like the World Fair Trade Organization and the rep organization I represent, the Fair Trade Federation. We verify the entire organization where product certification is just one product along one supply chain where the whole company might not be fair trade. We verify the entire organization. So what's important is that the, the service that we provide is verifying the practices of the organization so that buyers know when they sell those products, they can be assured that the products do not come at the cost of the health, environment, or dignity of the person that made the product, which we feel is really, really important and we know is resonating with consumers more increasingly in today's marketplace. Of course, yeah, and that sort of takes the pressure off of the retailer from having yes. to do all the research on their own because you guys have already done that for them. They're already so busy running a business themselves as an entrepreneur, so that's really a great benefit that we have for our members as well. Absolutely, but what can retailers who do want to do a bit more of their own digging in and research, what can they do, what sort of questions should they be asking? Yeah, that's a great question. Going beyond the label because there are multiple approaches to fair trade is really important. So asking questions of your vendors about the suppliers that they use, how do they communicate with them, how do they set prices and terms, and getting behind the story, behind the labels is really, really important. And building long-term relationships, those are really core a core tenement of fair trade um, in general. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Those are some great tips. I hope you guys got something out of this and thank you so much for tuning in.